My name is Mary Poffinroth, and I'm an adjunct professor of biology, and today I'm going to talk about natural selection. Natural selection, or survival of the fittest, was one of Darwin's mechanisms for explaining how evolution worked. Natural selection is based on change, and our environment is constantly changing. Things warm up, things cool down, continents shift, plagues come, and plagues go. So things are always in flux. It's important to note a few things about evolution, though. Evolution can only happen on a population, and evolution happens from random mutations. There is no organism, even including ourselves, that can will themselves to change their DNA and will themselves to evolve. Also, keep in mind that if a mutation does not predominate in a population, then it's not considered evolution. So let's use a fun little example. Let's say I was born with webbed feet. I didn't have a choice, it was just a random mutation, and that's the way it is. On dry land, it's not so easy to have webbed feet. It makes it really hard to run and impossible to buy shoes. Now let's say, as our global temperatures increase and our polar ice caps begin to melt, our world becomes covered in water. Now who's the weird one? Now that the environment has changed, my adaptations make me more advantageous to the environmental conditions. I'm better adapted to getting resources, and now that I can get resources, I can live long enough to pass those genes on to the next generation. Thanks for watching, and if you want to learn more about this subject, click on the link below. Or if you want to learn more biology, feel free to click on any links around me. And please, rate, comment, and subscribe to this channel. Or maybe, if you have ideas for more videos, send us an email at requests at mahalo.com. Thanks for learning.